I'm not gonna lie. Oh, seeing 34 people come out tonight made me so happy. Oh, breath of fresh air to get 10 extra entrants. Agreed. That and just a lot of PR players. But like yeah. Nam coming back, like it feels like it's he, been Nam forever. has been like everything has been going against Nam <laughs> for him to try and come to a Smash field recently. It's just been every time he tries to come, the, like the the he just, it just can't happen. The, the the world is not letting him come to a Smash field. Anyway, Smash vs. Aquatic, the last Winner's Quarters qualifier on stream. Smasher finally coming back after a hiatus. This has been pretty good. This is his second Smash Field in a row. Uh, he came to Smash Field last week. Then he was at Craves and Controllers, where he took a set off Daybreak, which was like their first set in like half a year or something like that. So Smasher starting to get into some playing form, trying to practice up for Big House, Little Big House. So let's see what he can do. Aquatic. Started this uh, PR season off kind of on a tear, but everybody might have been forgetting how to fight the Smasher 1001 Mega Man just because of how uh, uncommon his appearance has been over the course of the past like three months. So we'll see, because right now, Aquatic is doing pretty good. He's really kind of uh, not letting Smasher set up the, the, the zone that his Mega Man's so much known for with the Wall of Lemons, the nice intricate use of Metal Blade and the Leaf Shield. Oh, that should be... Wow, what a great angle. Oh, no. That's that's not good. Oh, Smash need to go off stage. Oh, Smash, that's going to get the kill, though. I always forget what that up Smash is called. That was so good. I love seeing the Rush Trap. Burns off guarantees uh, the burn of the invincibility frames from respawn. Oh! Oh, that should be dead. 4% yikes. <laughs> Wow. Smasher 1001. On th a dominating two stock here in game one against Aquatic. So this is going to be that last little stock. Boom. Uses the rush. Gear like burns the. Uh, I mean, if most other characters couldn't fall that fast to actually get some type of. Wow. He, he shouldn't have side B there. I think he was. I think he was trying to buffer something. And he messed up. Anyway, it's Town and City. I like the choice. You get uh, this helps a lot. Fox out a lot. Gets the uh, early potential kills off the top. And this stage, the way the platforms lay out, they really work for him. But be even though you kind of get that FD uh, that's like Smasher really is looking for, Fox is I think going to benefit more from an FD variant variation than like Town and City would. Wow, beautiful Mega Upper. Smasher 1001. Really putting the 101 on how to play the Fox versus Mega Man matchup right now. Doing so good. Only taking like 64% on his first stock. And Aquatic, he's got a big hill to climb. And that hill is going to be filled with a barrage of lemons. Oh, wow. He didn't even try to go for like the jab reset stuff. He's like, I'm going to just lemon lemon do the lemon hitbox part. Ooh. He should be dead. Yeah, he got caught out of the jump right there. He was going for a little style point with that, like, going off stage there. And he got uh, caught from it. Now, this that's the opening that Aquatic needs here. This is where you go for, like, the fair footstool to cheese your way back in. Go for the jab. Just get that easy peasy percent. Just what he needs. Got to hit. Got to get that percent to bring it back. Ooh. He had to jump there because Fox's linear recovery is just easy pickings for Mega Man. Interesting dash there. Oh my god, I thought he was going for Metal Blade, Lemon Lemon, and then maybe a uh, Mega Upper. One back, I think a back here though would kill, but oh my god, if he, Fast Faller, Fast Faller privileges right there, falling out of uh, Tornado. 144%. This is, I mean, he, any any decently strong hit from Mega Man back air, um, maybe even a back throw at the ledge, would definitely spell doom for Aquatic. But at that same token, this is starting to get into semi-scary territory, even for Mega Man, who is such a heavyweight. Oh, oh! Not confident in... That was really good. That was really good by Smasher. Such a good mix-up on his recovery. 
because he knew he was two framed, or he knew he was on second regrab. Oh, that was such an unsafe dash deck, but he lives barely because of Mega Man's hefty weight. Smasher trying to just find a little way in. Aquatic not gonna give it to him, but just like that, a quick chip away. And Smasher advances with a 2-0 victory over Aquatic. Aquatic almost bringing that one back. That was so close. Like.